Hi everybody and welcome back to another daily dose of Jace Tutorials. Today we're going to back up our Mac Mini which is on Mojave uh, using Time Machine. So first thing I'm going to do, we want to plug in our external hard drive. USB, nothing fancy. Boom. And then on our desktop I'm going to show you guys that we have the Toshiba EXT which is what I named the external hard drive. Now I am going to do a search for system preferences. You might also have it on your dock if it's set that way. So let's open up our system preferences here. And then I will show you guys time machine. I think for this computer it is, yep, it is in the bottom row. All right. Now you can back up automatically, which is highly recommended. For me, this is spare computer. I don't really have much on it. So I just back up maybe like once every six months or something. So next thing we want to do is we want to select our disk. So I'm just going to select this disk, which is Toshiba EXT. And then if you wanted to encrypt the backup and put a password on it, you can. I'm not going to do that since I don't have anything important here. And then now I'm going to erase this external hard drive. Uh, keep in mind that, you know, you can make a copy of this stuff inside. I don't have much on it, but I did make a copy of it on the desktop right here so it is preparing it and it is erasing the external right now okay it's going well now you can also exclude things from your backup which is what I really like about time machine usually when I image computers I'm um, using other stuff and uh, for PC I just image the entire thing but what I like is it's pretty convenient that you can exclude certain things that you don't want to be backed up I'm just going to uncheck backup automatically and then let's open it up again and backup now. So on the upper right corner, boom. So let me open up our time machine preferences again. Just to show you guys the ETA. So I do have the show time machine in menu bar. That's why it shows up on the upper right corner by the Wi-Fi or the digital clock, the time I mean. Um, we're going to uncheck that later once the backup is done. So you can see that we have an ETA here. It looks like I have under 70 gigs of data, so not a lot. I've never been uh, a heavy data user. I like to try and uh, clear out my stuff as much as possible So because I get confused easily. So here is a screenshot that I took when there were, s there were seven minutes uh, remaining on the backup. So it was pretty quick. Backup complete notification on the upper right. So we are pretty much good to go. Let me uncheck the... Okay, that's unchecked already. We are pretty much good to go. So it gives you a time. And another good thing about Time Machine, you know, um, there, I just eject it like that. So the external, the icon change, it's like a Time Machine um, icon. So I just ejected that. Now let me open up the Time Machine preferences again. I'm just going to uncheck the Time Machine and menu bar because I don't need to see it. I'm, I'll back up in another few months. But um, if you want to have it open, uh, sure, it's, that'd be great for you, If uh, especially if you do backup automatically. But other than that, that's pretty much all I have. Thank you for watching. Take it easy.